ever walked through one of the most haunted cities in the world? Here are York's creepiest spots. York is renowned for its ghost tours, and several operators offer spine-chilling walks through the city's haunted streets. Popular tours like the original Ghost Walk of York and Ghost Hunt of York take you to historical sites, narrow alleyways, and ancient buildings, while guides recount tales of ghostly apparitions, medieval murders, and spooky folklore. For an interactive and immersive spooky experience, the York Dungeon offers a theatrical journey through 2,000 years of York's gruesome history. From the Viking invasion to the plague, the dungeon brings to life the most terrifying stories of torture, ghosts, and execution with actors, special effects, and chilling performances. Known as one of the most haunted pubs in England, the Golden Fleece has a reputation for paranormal activity. Several ghosts are said to haunt this 16th century building, including a Roman soldier, a Canadian airman, and Lady Alice Peckett. Many visitors have reported strange occurrences such as moving objects, eerie shadows, and ghostly apparitions. This medieval castle, perched on a hill in the heart of York, is home to many tragic and eerie stories. Clifford's Tower is said to be haunted by the ghosts of Jews who were massacred there in 1190, and people have reported seeing apparitions and hearing strange noises in and around the site. The Treasurer's House is known for its famous ghost story, where a workman reportedly saw a Roman legion marching through the basement in 1953. The eerie tale has since attracted paranormal enthusiasts. The house itself is filled with historic artifacts and has a spooky ambiance, especially when you know the ghostly history. The Shambles is one of the oldest streets in York, dating back to the medieval period, and is said to be haunted by spirits of the past. Walking through this narrow, cobbled street after dark, with its overhanging, timber-framed buildings, offers an eerily atmospheric experience. York Minster, the city's iconic cathedral, is not just a place of worship, but is also known for its paranormal activity. Ghost sightings in the Minster include the spirit of Dean Gale, a former cleric, who has been seen wandering the corridors. The grandeur of the cathedral combined with its ghost stories makes it a spooky visit. The hauntingly beautiful ruins of St. Mary's Abbey are often associated with ghost sightings and a mysterious atmosphere. Walking through the darkened remains at dusk can make for an eerie and surreal experience. Another haunted pub, the Black Swan Inn, dates back to the 15th century and is said to be haunted by multiple spirits including a Victorian gentleman in a bowler hat and a woman in a long white dress. The pub's rich history and ghost stories make it a popular destination for those seeking a supernatural thrill. Though it may sound quirky, the tiny street of Whitmawapma Gate has eerie associations and is home to some dark tales. While the name itself may draw attention, the street has a somewhat mysterious history and is a fun place to visit during a ghost walk. If you enjoyed this video, please give it a like. Let us know if you have visited any of the places mentioned and experienced anything. And give us a follow if you enjoy all things spooky. Until next time.